guys welcome to my channel so in today's video I'm going to show you my dressing room and my flat where I'm living right now because as you probably remember I did a video when I lived in Bristol about my dressing room because there I had a small dressing room where I had only my coats and shoes and my dressing table and I really loved it because it was one of the big dreams for me so I was really happy with it but because I decided to move back to Hungary, I moved to a new place, obviously. And this flat is only a one bedroom flat. So I have one bedroom and a living room and a kitchen and a bathroom. In my bedroom, I have my wardrobe as well because it's a little bit bigger sized room than the rooms in England. So half of the room is my bed and the other half is like a dressing room, kind of. And this where I'm sitting now is in the living room. I have my sofa over there and then I have my dressing table here. And right now, to be honest, the flat is already full. I don't really have more space for clothes and shoes again. So I just feel like it's really time to sort out my stuff and just to get rid of a few things because honestly, I have no space at all. No space for any more clothes or shoes. This is something that I will need to do in the next few weeks, definitely, to check everything and get rid of the clothes and shoes that I'm not really using. So yeah, I'm just going to show you now the flat and the dressing room slash bedroom okay so let's start by the entrance so this is the entrance over here and there is this big mirror i took this one from bristol i really love these big mirrors there and i also love them here so this is the entrance here this door is actually really noisy and it's really annoying because whenever i open it i guess Everyone can hear it in this building and it's just really annoying. We are trying to fix it, so I hope it's going to be fixed soon. So then from the entrance, there is this small hallway. So straight from the entrance, there is this hallway. I have some storage in here like Hoover and cleaning stuff. And then there is the kitchen. First I have a mirror here, so I took the black mirror, what we had in the kitchen in Bristol and I put it on the wall here and after like two days it fell down and it was absolutely broken so I had to buy this white one because I couldn't find any black one anywhere and just the white one so that's why I have white because the kitchen mainly is grey and black so I didn't really think white is going to be nice here but that's what i have now i have the kitchen rules kitchen table not huge and it's not like very very spacious but it's absolutely fine for one, two or even three people. I really love that the windows are so huge and I'm so excited for spring and summer because the flat is just going to be so light and I just love it. <laughs> and then from the entrance to this direction I have this bench for shoes, it's a little bit messy now, so I'll have to sort this out. And then next to this was an empty space where we put one of my wardrobes for the shoes. Because there was no space for this one in the room, so it was a perfect space. This wardrobe is matching. So this space was just perfect for this wardrobe in here. And then here is my room. So, as we step into the room, straight away is my kind of dressing room. So I have my wardrobes here. I have all my shoes, skirt, and then I have my clothes. And there 
isn't too much space in here as you can see they are really like crowded in here so I definitely need to check out what I need and what I don't and then as we step in from the door on the right side I have these storage shelves or I don't even know how it's called so I decided to buy it and put it here because I wanted to separate my kind of dressing room part from the bedroom part and I think it looks actually quite nice like that because it's separating the two spaces in the room so then here I have yeah some mirrors of course <laughs> So as we are coming out from the room, on the left there are two doors, the first is the bathroom, the second is the toilet. So the bathroom, these are really really small, it's literally just these storage shelves. I have the laundry and I have a shower in here. toilet here it's literally just a toilet um, it's really really tiny so there is nothing to show about it to be honest and so from the entrance to the right side is the living room so I have this unit here with the TV I haven't watched TV not even once since I'm here because I'm usually just watching on my laptop Netflix and that's it Here's the door to the balcony, which is a pretty good sized balcony, it's not tiny. It's definitely going to be amazing in spring and summertime to have a table there and some chairs and just to sit there and have a drink or coffee in the morning. My favorite corner. I have the ring light here, I have my dressing table, I have my dressing table here, That's all. Uh, it is a really small flat, but I really like how it turned out because most of the furniture is from England, from Bristol, from the house where I lived. And I just love this style, this white and grey. And then the rest of the furniture I bought here, but everything is kind of matching. It's uh, really simple and it's like lots of white. I actually love the uh, simple interiors. So I'm really happy with it, how it turned out. And I'm also happy that I have a little bit bigger size of bedroom. So we managed to put there my wardrobes and I have kind of a dressing room there. Definitely in the future, um, next when I'm moving, I want to move to a bigger house where I can have a big, big room, a dressing room, because it's still on my list. It's still my dream to have a much bigger dressing room where I have space for my dressing table. And of course, I have lots of more wardrobes for my clothes and shoes. I hope you liked this video. Thank you for watching and I will see you soon. Bye!